day at sea for general public and families. This is part of the program conducted annually in the month of February, coinciding with the Coast Guard Day functions. We start these activities by engaging with the public uh, in the form of uh, art competition, cleaning up the beaches, and also troops get together and several other activities. And finale, you can say, is the conduct of day at sea with the families, mainly the Coast Guard family, which was conducted yesterday. Today, for general public and for public officials, and tomorrow is for the people who have been helping us, especially the port personnel, CIS, police, uh, and port uh, workers. Uh, and, so, and so also, we're trying to include some school children and college children. How long is that? I think the last was conducted in 2018. Uh, after that, uh, COVID struck, and we can't uh, have this kind of crowded, uh, you know, activity taking place, especially on board a ship. Even our personnel also were uh, ships are affected by COVID also. So that apart, we didn't have uh, that kind of assets, you know, to conduct um, this day at sea. We minimum required a minimum of six ships. Today we had eight ships participating and two or four aircrafts required. Today, six aircraft, two don't have also participated. When all this comes together, then we can have a good day at sea. If you have only two ships and two aircrafts, um, there's no fun. So, luckily, this time, uh, with our effort and support coming from our headquarters, and also uh, my team working very hard around the clock and ensure that, you know, uh, everything is conducted uh, according to the position of clock. Uh, whoever has come has said very positively about the experience. I think most of them are first timer also. That is good because people who would have seen previous versions, they always compare the previous version was bad, the best, uh, this version was best or something. But I didn't have any complaints coming. Everybody enjoyed it. Amazing. So seeing all the uh, colleagues of my uncle, so meeting them and it's nice. It's a dance altogether because we are, we are always on the shore. We don't know what's happening around in sea, right? So when you're here and seeing the people, seeing the Coast Guards, what they do every day and they end out how, what are their experiences and we get to know what they uh, do and uh, right from their food, their uh, experience, their um, their colleagues, their family, it's a good experience actually. It's a mesmerizing experience for me, I can say, because we, I haven't seen that, but uh, uh, last time when I saw also it was not this uh, spectacular, so this time it was very spectacular. So This is my third time here, I've been here like four years ago, it was quite regular then, but after COVID this was quite stopped for like four years now. And after 2020, this is the first time it's been resuming, I believe, and this is a very good experience because you, you have to pay to come to see, that's not very easy here. But this experience is so good because you are amidst a lot of officers and the, the way they treat you, it's so dignified and they treat you well, it's, it's, it's quite a good experience and I really love it.